Hi everyone, my name is Sebastian and I'm a freelancer, so I don't have my own office. But uh, I'm on the move all the time and between two customer meetings, I often need a desk to settle down, get some, something done, and I need to find a place like right here, right now. And it has, of course, it must have all the accommodations that I need to get something done. Problem is, how can I find such a place today? That's my problem. Hi everyone, I'm Ellie um, of Larish. Larish is the name of my company. Uh, two years ago I did a big investment on my office infrastructure. Uh, however, due to the crisis, I had to make 20, 10 of my employees uh, redundant. So that uh, leaves me with 10 unused desks. Hi, I'm Dan and I'm from Codesk. And over the weekend we developed a solution for these people. So first of all, we developed a solution for Sebastian to solve his problem because he will be able with our solution to go online, look for an available desk, book it and pay it all in one click. And for Ellie, we also solved the problem because Ellie can with our application put her vacant office space online for rent so that freelancers can book it. Now let me show you how it works in a little demo. So imagine that you have a smartphone. I guess you all have smartphones. Who has no smartphone here? <laughs> wow. <laughs> okay. So imagine you have a smartphone. You download the application on your smartphone. After you register in the system, you can very easily look up a spot with a desk with a simple search query. The result is a map with you positioned in the center of the world as a tree. <coughs> And you can see around you the available spaces with extra information. If you click on them, you get information about availability and about price. You can also book it online immediately by linking it to, a, to your Visa account or to your PayPal account, like in this case. The price in this case is, for example, 10 euros. You click on the system and it's reserved. Now, how is the business model working? It's as simple as can be. Sebastian pays Codex for the booking. We do a transfer payment to Ellie, and we get a commission, period. And our marketing uh, approach is, is basically twofold because we have two different target groups. On the one hand, we have the freelancers, and we, we will try to create a community with viral marketing tactics like word of mouth and Twitter. And on the other hand, we have uh, the, uh, the office vendors, and we will use direct sales techniques to contact them, cold calling, and visit them. Now, the funny thing is, can it be that simple? Isn't someone already doing this? Well, the answer is not here, not in Europe. So we found a spot in the market where there is no one pos positioned as an online, short-term broker for desk space. No one. It exists in the States, and there is a company there who has proved that the business model is working, and this is what we discovered over the weekend. What we want to do, and what our ambition is with the team, is to take this model and roll it out in Europe. And therefore, we need your help. Now, I know that there is a lot of freelancers here available. Can, can they raise their hands? I want to see the freelance. Oh, wow. Now, I need your help because you will be entitled to be our early adopter customers. Now, are there also people in the audience here who have office space for it? Wow. Well, this is, this is great news. <laughs> because you, you, you feel the chemistry, we already have something going here. So you, you can register with Ellie and leave your business cards for after this meeting. But the good, news is, the good news is we already have our bootstrap here. Now the next step is to, uh, to develop a technical application. And this is something we can do ourselves, together with your help. And the next step is to scale this up for Belgium and in a later phase for Europe. Now this has been the dream of the entire Codex team that has been grown over the weekend 
and it was a great weekend. And as you can see, it's pretty balanced. So there's a, a <coughs> all kinds of people. Uh, but anyway, we really believe in this model. And uh, uh, thank you for One is on deck. You want the mic? <laughs> Thanks. Love the idea. Uh, I think there's a couple things you should think about in terms of uh, creating your own currency. Uh, because I'd love to have my office space available for other people, but if I can have some bonus points scored, I'm going to use those when I'm on my next trip to Paris, for example. So I think there's some, some additional things you can think of in your model. Second is the 10% commission. You go for 2030. <laughs> Actually, so the, the commission model is just this, the core business model. We already thought of, of other possible instruments on which we can some buttons on which we can push to kind of optimize the model. Only with this we are already we already have some very good figures, but we we can add some things more and definitely uh, like. Uh, Establishing a reputation model so that uh, people can uh, get reviewed themselves and then places can get reviewed and so on and uh, give incentive to people that have good reputation and so on. This is definitely something that we thought about. But thanks for the, for the good feedback. I think we can raise this commission. <laughs> <laughs>